Hi, I'm Megan. And I'm Andrew. And welcome to Cooking, Cooking Stage, Stage Left. Left. The show where we teach you how to make something delicious. So what are we making this episode? Well, today we're going to make ice cream. And we're going to make ice cream that is vegan. It is gluten-free. Right. There's no processed sugar in it. And only has one ingredient. Really? Really. All right. Yeah, yeah. Let's, I'm just ah. gonna, and we'll just wait until we get to the ingredients list to talk about that. Okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. Great. So here we go. Curtains, Curtains up, up, burners on. on. We're going to make our ice cream, our super simple ice cream. And here's the one ingredient I was talking about. Banana. Ta -da. Yeah. So basically with a banana, you can make an ice cream that doesn't really taste super banana-y, uh -huh. in my opinion, and, uh, and comes together really, really quickly. So right. um, yeah, so the way that you do it is you just basically cut up the banana. And just okay, like, great. Give that a chop. You cut it into like one or two inch pieces. Peel it first, yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> just want to clarify. Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't clear. <laughs> okay, great. So just like little pieces? Yeah, yeah. Like again, like, you know, one or two inches. Yeah. Okay, great. And then yeah. you put it in a little baggie. Okay. And you stick it in the freezer. Okay. And then you do have to freeze it for a few hours. Okay. So the, the cool idea here is to kind of always, you know, if you, if you decide you want to do this, it's just keep some bananas in the yeah. freezer. Yeah. That's there. Perfect. There's our frozen bananas. Awesome. Okay. So to make your banana ice cream, again, you need your frozen banana pieces, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, after you take them out of the freezer, you want to have them wait just, you know, hang out for like a couple of minutes. Yeah. And then we're gonna put them right into our food processor here. Great. You can also use a blender for this. If you have like a high powered blender, you can use that. Sure. Um, so you're just gonna like pop them in there. Okay. And that just slides off just like that. Great. Let's go ahead and put a couple. Mm. Do I just let's, do those? Let's try the okay. one. Great. So I can play with it. And then just go ahead and turn it on. It's a little creepy. Let's give it a little bit of a scrape down. Okay. Texture too, right? Mm -hmm. The texture is totally creamy, like ice cream. It really is. Now you can also add some flavor to this. Uh huh. So you can just throw in some cocoa powder and you can make chocolate ice cream. Throw in some peanut butter, make peanut butter ice cream. Yeah. Maple syrup, anything like that. Sure. If you want to sort of like uh, mask a little bit of banana flavor, and again, it doesn't taste super strong with banana, weirdly. Mm -hmm. No. I think, um, but you can put a little, a uh, little dab of vanilla in there. I was gonna say vanilla would be really good in here. Yeah. Yeah. Vanilla and honey, maybe? Mm-hmm. Really nice. Yeah. There you go. Super ridiculously easy one ingredient easy. ice cream. Yeah. Um, once again, I'm Andrew. I'm Megan. And this has been Cooking, Cooking Stage, Stage Left. Left. Mm. 
really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs>